Hello friends, welcome to Sandeep's Biology. So in this video, I'll be talking about osmoregulation in aquatic animal and especially in fishes. So let's take an example of fish and understand what is osmoregulation. So in case of freshwater environment, the fish that are living in freshwater environment, so I will draw a diagram of fish here. So as we know that the salt concentration is higher inside the body as compared to the outer environment, right? So the concentration of the salt is higher inside the body and is low in fresh water. So salt is moving out and water is coming in, right? So to prevent the excess removal of the salt, Fish have several adaptation. Fishes have scales which prevent excess loss of salt and the fish does not drink water. So freshwater fishes do not drink water. So water is not going inside the elementary canal. Of course it is passing through the gills for respiration. So freshwater fish does not drink water and to prevent excess loss of salt they have scales right and the water that is entering inside the body is removed through hypotonic urine. So the urine is less concentrated having high quantity of water. So water, excess water is removed through the hypotonic urine. Now the fish that is living in sea water. So I am drawing a diagram of fish. So in this scenario, in case of seawater, the salt concentration is higher in seawater, right? And the salt concentration is lower as compared to the outer environment inside the body. So salt is continuously moving inside the body in the case of seawater. And water is moving outside the body, right? So salt is continuously moving inside the body and water is going outside the body. The fish is continuously losing water. So to prevent this, salt water fishes drink water. Right? So water is going inside the elementary canal. And there is one more mechanism that these fish release hypertonic urine urine that is having less water and more salt less water and more salt so water is excreted in lower amount in the form of hypertonic urine and this fish continuously drinks water to maintain the water balance inside the body. And the excess salt entering inside the body is also removed through the hypertonic urine and it is also removed through the gill membrane. So gills membrane. Right? So that is the water balance or salt balance in seawater fishes. So osmoregulation is regulation of salt and water inside the body. So regulation of salt and water inside 
body that is called osmoregulation and this is how osmoregulation is done in fresh water and sea water fishes i hope this video is helpful if you are watching this video till here please hit the like button share this video with your friends subscribe to my channel thank you for watching